Hello everyone, I got a little update here. We had the effects from the hurricane come through and made it a little interesting here. Got pretty good heavy rain. A little flooding here. I can't really explore the edge of the creek very well. I got normally this is about, I don't know, almost a foot higher than it normally is. Normally I can walk out there a little more, but, oh, got the train, but, got this little, little bit of extra water from the rain we had, but, I've been cleaning up. Had some holes in the ground. I filled them in and got them so I don't trip on them anymore. A little bit right there. Just little dips in the. Just enough to twist your ankle. So we got uh, filled them in a little bit. Fishing area, I got that all. I keep, I've been keeping that clean up, and that's that's being nice to have. So I can go fishing once in a while. I don't get much time to go fishing, but I do go. In the backyard, going like crazy. Can't seem to keep up with it. I just cut it a few days ago and it's already too tall. Some more holes I filled in. That area keeps washing out so I keep filling it in. I got a hole there I filled in. Another one there. A few here and there. There was rocks and those I had to get out. Kept tripping over the rocks, so I got rid of those and filled them in. Yep, water's a little high. Finally got that carpet that was by the creek. I think finally uh, got enough junk off the top of it. it I just grabbed a hold of it the other day and Come right out, and I also got the oh boy, there was a car hood and a piece of pipe down there, too. And finally, got enough ambition to pull that out of the water so it can, it's not sitting there rotting in the water. Filled this hole in, and I filled a couple other ones in, small ones. One there, and a couple down through there, where I kept stepping and almost twisting my ankle. Nice to get that car hood out of there, then. The, now these weeds can grow back where that was keeping these weeds from growing and we need those along the edge of the creek so I get that got that out of there they can grow back it can go back the way it should be no need for car parts to be in the creek That's the carpet I pulled out of there. I think it finally, I've been cleaning it. I've been keeping it clear of debris and I think finally it 
broke down on either end or I just had a lot of ambition the other day and I just ripped it out. Either way, it's it's out of there now. And I don't have to worry about it in there. I, yeah, I still got some sticks and stuff. But, yeah, this kind of grows up during the summer. It looks narrower than it is because all this grows out towards the trail. And I really have to take my brush cutter and knock this back a couple feet on either side. And it gets out of control. This is starting to grow in nice, slowly. It's grown in quite a ways already, and some of the there's some stuff growing in there. I just keep cutting it down with a lawnmower and this trimmer. And this will be all lawn before we know it. That'll be a nice that'll be a nice area. Once we finish picking all the trash out of there, I keep there's some more trash that's coming up now that I've got. The um bulk of it out of there and I got all the dead brush out of there and starting to um, more stuff surfacing so I keep cleaning that up but yeah, it won't be long a lot of this clover spreading pretty fast and starting to cover that I wouldn't doubt by the end of the summer most of this will be covered. It's really started taking off the last few weeks. And you got all of August, August, September, and some of October. That'll be decent. So, almost three months of growing left. I still gotta get rid of that insulation. Keep forgetting trash bags. This here got a little bit of bare spots. They're they're starting to fill in. A little squishy here. But, uh, this keeps washing out. I keep adding material and rocks, and I keep taking these rocks and throwing them back up on the hill. Now that the grass is growing up there and it's filling in really nice, it's not washing out nowhere near what it used to be. We'll go through our little path here. Yeah, this is filling in nice. Won't be long before this is all filled in nicely. Couple bare spots, couple thin spots, nothing too bad. Got my truck back, that one had to be fixed. Frame felt was having issues. Fire pit, big table. Camper had to move that. I have to deal with the, some issues with the permits to make sure I'm legal there. Put some topsoil here and put seed, but it didn't really take. It kind of washed away, but some of it's taking. And hopefully, that won't be long before 
that's filled in. Got a couple bare spots, but it's filling in pretty fast. It's also filling in all the way around the road. But we got everything set up here. These are some of the rocks I got out of the backyard. Got them all picked up out of the backyard. Some of them are pretty buried pretty deep. So I had to take a make a bigger hole before I could fill the hole in. Bottom only stuck up a few inches, but just enough for one more to hit, so I wanted to get rid of them and they're tripping over. But that's about all I have, yeah, campers here until I can hopefully get all the proper permits, thanks to the wonderful government, but hopefully that'll all go well this week, and we'll have that all taken care of soon, within the next couple months, but I appreciate you watching. Um, yeah, let me see. Yeah, I'm start. I got some bricks and stuff from somebody too. I'm filling in here slowly. I like the. I like the stuff that grows along the bank. It kind of screens me. But thanks for watching. Another another thing we got set up the other day, we we did get slick fiber that were in the area. So we had them hook up and we got internet through them now. And that's much better. We can watch movies. Everything works better with the faster internet. Have a nice day. Thanks for watching.